exercise and increases scale to muscle mitochondrial content and cellular respiratory capacity. Well, those are big words. We're going to get to that in a second. Allowing for greater use of fat and sparing the muscle body. This is one of the hallmark adaptations to aerobic exercise or endurance training, is that you make more mitochondria. And if you remember back to high school chemistry and high school biology class, what are mitochondria do? What happens inside that mitochondria? The powerhouse of the cell. That's right. Did we have the same biology teacher? Because my teacher said the same thing. My biology teacher in high school was the golf coach. He was a weird guy. Mr. Brick. B-R-Y-C-K. Never forget it. He talked about the mitochondria. That's why I first learned about mitochondria. I owe it all to Mr. Brick. <laughs> so mitochondria is where aerobic metabolism takes place. Why? What? You remember back to, has anybody studied exercise science, exercise physiology? What energy pathway, what, I'm giving a little bit away here, what cycle is inside the mitochondria? The Krebs cycle that's inside the mitochondria. And so the more mitochondria we have, the more Krebs cycle activity we have, and the more fat can ultimately be burned. 